Good morning, CX gang. <sighs> it's too early for me to look that scary. Also, can you hear me? Should I get audio? Ugh, effort. Um, welcome back. Sorry if I look literally crusty. I took a and I put on new shower curtains and kind of clean the shower. Yeah, I got issues. But nonetheless, I'm gonna show you my little morning routine. Aside from the stuff I just did, including getting the camera set up and facing it the way I like it, if I even like it, we're just rolling with the punches. Punching with the rollins. First thing I like to do is make up my bed. Now, if my alarm goes off, don't be alarmed. <laughs> put I will never regret chilling out on my day off I really could have chose to take my one day off really one day off to be ahead to do too much to organize my home life outside of work which would have just been working continuously for seven days straight to tell you the truth it was very needed for me to relax because my body wasn't having it my body need my body said hey ma'am miss please Relax. Because I did relax, at least for a large chunk of it, I feel a lot better today. Because I know, deep down, I know that today would have sucked if I didn't really, for real, chill out. Like, I actually didn't do that at all. But today, I feel okay. Like, I feel like I can do today. Today ain't gonna do me. I'm gonna do today. Also, I feel like I get in this sensory mode of panic when I don't have to panic. For a while now, I've been working a job that has really flexible hours. Like when I say really flexible, I mean, let me double check to make sure that today is the day I go in at 11. I also appreciate places that for your work has an app to help you track when you go in today. Okay, so yes, today I go in from 11 to 4.45. So just like that, I could boom, let my anxiety chill out for a second because I'm realizing I don't have to be there immediately. Like, this is still the morning. I'm still ahead of my alarm that goes off to say, hey, this is your random lollygagging time, but you also need to turn up and like get ready. Whenever I get lucky enough to have the privilege to be up before my get the on alarm I get to choose what I want to do so like I could choose to edit I could choose to work out I could choose to eat breakfast now I can't do all of these things I could really try if I really was really about it but trust me I just just really recovered from like feeling not even ill because I wasn't even sick but I just I knew I pushed my body to its limits and that's not something I like to do, or at least often. But just getting up, getting ready, getting up, getting ready, keep going, keep going, keep going, that will do you dirty. It doesn't even feel like a lot like, but it can be a lot to like get up at a certain time, make yourself presentable every day, going in, working, coming back, and like having a proper de-stress routine, like decompress routine is also crucial. Not that I have one, but I'm gonna hop on that too. So I guess what I'm gonna choose right now is to journal. I have Le Journal. That's like newspaper in French. I don't know why I said that. I'm also thinking I want to have something to eat, but that's definitely cutting into my, what else do I want to do? Cause what I need to do is my hair. I'm not gonna wash it or anything. There's, there's simply not enough time for that, but I do want to restyle it. And that might take a bit more time than what I really would like to, but it is what it is. So the plan looks like journaling, fixing myself something to eat, and working out. See, my workouts, they're pretty cut and dry. I do like a 10 minute workout, and it's really based on how I feel. Like I might do 10 minutes of stretching and call that a workout. The day before yesterday, I did like a 10 minute leg workout, and I didn't feel that until a day later. Like literally the next day. Legs, thighs, body sore. I was like, whoa. Not me genuinely trying to work out and it back burning on me. But either way, I still want to keep up my health. I still want to be a healthy queen, but we gotta pick and choose our battles. Not everything is gonna work perfectly and you gotta, you really gotta be choosing to be choosing. Don't worry about the lights. The lights be, be lighting, okay? Yeah, don't worry about it. You worried about a lot, don't do it. After doing a bit of reflecting, that's why I like to do the journal reading first. It lets me get the, the thoughts. It helps me get the thoughts going. So I think I still wanna chill out for today. Like really, really designed to be a 
and do the most to get my morning right for me, not worth the hell. I'm still like, I'm feeling just good enough to go with it. But like the energy is on reserve. Like I can't, gotta be honest with myself. I can't do it all. No matter how bad I want it to all be done, I really gotta choose. And today I'm choosing to fuel myself with food, use the energy I have left to whip something up right quick. Give me a little energy drink, hold on. Cause you know what's sad? Is that because my hours are so weird, I guess. Oh, the scissors. Work smarter, not harder. Because my hours are so frugal, I don't always get a lunch, like a proper lunch. So it is in my best interest that I kind of eat something before. Which isn't bad, it just takes time to like prepare a meal, you know? It takes time to know what I wanna eat, bro. I have to think what I wanna eat, how fast am I gonna be able to eat it? Will it be enough to satisfy me type, you know? Another thing I'm also working on is not being upset when things don't work out perfectly the way I plan. Like trust me, I'm a perfectionist. I've been a perfectionist. I've been working on my perfectionism since day one. But the worst and best part is knowing what you can choose and what you can't choose. I can't choose them all, even though I desperately want to, but I can choose a couple. Like, I already used one of my little choices on doing that shower thing right there. That shower thing that I didn't even show you that I did earlier because I was, you know, desiring to be. I do too much. Even the little bit of energy it took me just to do that so I could easily grab one of these. Do I condone energy drinks? It's your life, man. Live it how you live it. Caffeine is just one of those things that it's like a source that helps me when I need some help, but it's not gonna critically like hinder me. Because when I tell y'all it's literally that simple, take the 10 minutes, take the 10 minutes. Even if it's just to stretch, just to stretch, bro. You can work on arms another day. You can work on legs another day. You can work on abs another day. Just stretch. I'm telling you that last exercise was just to breathe. Some of y'all ain't even breathing. Next up on the list is obviously getting around that time we finish shower. So yeah, I could start it off with like what I want to wear. So when I come back, it won't be as hectic. The less you have to think about it, really just grabbing whatever I first grasp out of my hand. One thing that I really need to invest in is a new speaker. I've been so cheap with myself and I really need to stop doing that. Like buy the speaker, but also I'm trying to buy other things that hinder me from wanting to buy other things. But this, let's see if she want to work today. She's loud, so don't be alarmed. Yeah, but sometimes like mid shower, she could be fully charged. Just took her off the sh charger type beat. What do I want to listen to though? I'm in kind of in a French mood. Let's go for the French dream playlist. Okay, so I've gotten ready, showered, brushed my teeth. I need to floss, but now I'm clearing my desk for the next task, which is hair and makeup. The battery definitely died on me, but this is the hair. Now for the face. All right, it's getting about that time. Holy shit, I have five minutes to get to work. That's not even funny. I'm not even playing, that's not even funny. I was doing too much. I was doing too much. Oh my God. Oh my gosh. I'll be back, bye. I'm back. Six hours later. Probably doesn't feel like it because y'all never left. When I was rushing to get on, to get on somewhere, that was me rushing. Luckily the system was down, so <laughs> it didn't matter anyways. 